Hi, it's Neil. Welcome back to my uh, family room. And today I have a lamp. Usually I'm playing around with different electronics or household things or something like that. But I have an extra bedroom in the house that I'm trying to finally finish to furnish. And I thought, what better way to furnish it than buying stuff on Amazon? So here we go. So this is the lamp. So we're going to unbox this and give it a try and see what it's like. Uh, it's Kekken. Kekken Yuo is the brand. If you look at it there, I'm guessing is the brand. Or maybe that means something in Chinese. Like, you know, buy this lamp. I have no idea. But you can see the lamp is this. It's supposed to light up as well as have some USB ports to charge. That was the whole concept of this was because it's going in a guest room. So when people come and visit, they'll be able to charge their devices with the lamp. So let's see what we got going on here. So it's packed in styrofoam here. I'm guessing I'm gonna need a light bulb for this. So I will run out to the car, or to the garage in a minute and grab one. But let's see how this looks. It's pretty light. I thought it would be a little heavier. Usually it's nice to have a little bit of a heft on the lamp. Let's see how it looks. It's got a slip. Okay, so. Sorry, I'm just getting a little mixed up here with all this stuff. So this is the lamp. So you can see it's got the traditional two-pronged plug, and then it's got a inline switch for it. And it also has the switch up here for it. Interesting. And then it's got the leaves because it was the style that I thought looked kind of earthy and whatnot for the, for the house. And then we've got two USB ports in there. Um, so let's see what else comes in the box here. We have, I'm guessing this is gonna be the lampshade for it. It's funny, I've never had to put one together myself, but we will figure it out here together. And then here's more of that. And here's our instructions. And I'm just gonna put the box over here, but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna be right back, I'm gonna grab it. Why the TV went on, but here we go, so we have the light bulb, put this in here. And I'm gonna plug this in and we're gonna give it a try just to see if it lights up without even doing any other stuff to make sure it works. this switch or that switch there but kind of interesting I guess I would just use this one all the time <clears throat> so it works and I'll try the USB ports on it right now and see if that works too so let me plug in the USB port and is it plugged into anything oh let's see where's that switch ah Okay, so I understand now the concept between the two switches. The switch on the bottom, right, let me undo this twisty here. So I'm gonna explain how it works here. <clears throat> okay, so you see there's the switch on the bottom and the switch up here. This switch is for the light and this switch is for everything. So if I wanna charge, I have to have this switch here on in order for it to charge. And if I turn it off, it stops charging. See, stop charging. And then I turn it on again and it'll start charging, see? And then it has to be on for this one to go too. Okay, so now that we've got that figured out, let's figure out how this lampshade works. I'm gonna put it right here so you can kind of see it as it goes, even though I have a table right here. And we're gonna open this up. Try to put this together. If I had scissors or something, it might be a little easier. But okay, cardboard. Boy, this company really likes twist ties. Look at all these little twisties on everything. There was like three of them on that wire, and now there's another three of them on this thing. Has anybody ever put together a lampshade before? 
kind of weird. I've never had to do this before. I've, I have a million lamps and I've never put together, built my own lampshade. Interesting. Um, let's get this off. Just unscrew. Oh, yeah. And there we go. There, now that's off of there. Oh, I'll leave that off. Throw all these things away. You like the way I'm trying this without even reading any of the instructions? It shouldn't be that hard. <clears throat> so that's going to be the shade. So it's, oh, it's got little clips. Okay, let me look. Let's see how it goes. So here's the instructions. So you can kind of get an idea of what I'm doing. So it goes faces down. So let's see. So this is going to clip in there. See, I'll, I'll get a little closer here. You see, this thing's got these little clips, like right there, the little clip, and then it just clips onto the onto the side like that. And then this part here is Velcro, so it's going to Velcro onto itself there. But I'm going to clip on the bottom ring just first to be sure. It's a really cool concept because then they can ship this thing in a tiny little box. I guess that's how they get away with it, even though it's got a lampshade. And then here, let me velcro this up. And there we go. There's a lampshade. Check it out. I built the lampshade. Woohoo! I'm an expert in it. And then if you've used these things before, it goes through the middle. And then it had that little piece that I unscrewed from the top that looks like a little leaf. I'll screw that sucker back on there. it on a little leaf turn but you know I guess you don't do it too tight and then if you've ever done these things you know these little clips on the bottom and these little rings you kind of squeeze them together you put the rings up squeeze it together put it on and whatever so let's put this on A fully built lamp. So let's turn it on. Ooh, look at that. Okay, so there we go. We have a lamp built, and it's <laughs> I still have my little phone plugged into it. I don't need that right now. But here we go. Can we get a good view at a distance? So this is what the lamp looks like on. It's actually pretty nice, and it'll look nice on the desk, and it'll have its two little. Uh, let me screw this on a little tighter. It'll have its two little. Oh, I can put the where the Velcro is on the back. There we go. There we go, it's got two ports in the front. So there we go, it just goes on the desk and people can charge. I like this lamp. I'm giving this one a thumbs up for its super ease of use and the way I was able to put it together. I put together a whole lamp basically just right now and it works. So that's pretty sweet. Um, and if I wanna shut everything down, I use this one right here. So now it's completely shut down, uh, so the ports won't work or anything. This here will turn on the ports and the light now, and I can turn off the light, and then my ports would still be live. So if I was going to sleep, I would want to turn it off this way, and otherwise it would stop charging. But there we go. So this is the lamp here, and let me see, is there anything else about it that we would need to know? Um, I just stuck an LED bulb in here, so it uses very low wattage. I don't know what the wattage is anymore of lamps because everything I use is LED. The bulbs are so cheap, they're like less than a dollar a piece. Um, and let's see, <clears throat> pretty much says everything we did. It's got a two year warranty, which is nice. So if something happened to it, I'm not sure what would really happen with a lamp, but maybe the charges would stop working or something. I don't know, but probably nothing. And that's it, the table lamp. And it came in this little box, this box. 
fit this whole lamp here. Kind of crazy, huh? <laughs> but I like it. I'm giving it a thumbs up. And a special thumbs up because it was a project and we got to put it together. And you got to help me. But thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe so I can keep buying some more fun things and decorate more of my house. And I'm getting another house soon, so we'll be have two houses to decorate. And it'll be uh, fun and exciting and you'll help me along the way. So any advice you have for this lamp or questions or anything, I'm an expert now at putting this together. So be sure and ask. And thanks again for watching and have a great day.